Howdy howdy and how do you do and welcome back to some Peglin. Yeah, my game is a little bit fishy right now. I don't know quite what's going on, but my PC is not loving me today. And it's kind of annoying, kind of just a little bit tiny bit annoying. I think I'm gonna go with improved catalyst. Might as well just get those bomb damage a little bit higher at the early part of this game. Now our goal is to discover what these new relics are. That's why we're on Crucible 10. Because Crucible 10 kind of leaves us a little bit more room to see what's up with this world. Give us a little bit more freedom whenever it comes to making builds. Unfortunately, I'm going to have to hit this bomb here. We're not going to have near enough Mune. We did take damage, which I'm not the biggest fan of taking some damage. Uh, nothing new here. I don't want to upgrade. You can save our money for the shop. Hit this elite. Hit that elite. We got good options here for... Uh, for getting some relics and see what these new relics can do. Or at least uncover what these relics are. I think that is more of the key to our salvation here. And collect as much money as we can so that at a shop we can purchase relics because the new what is it the new salt shaker and the new uh, gardener's glove are indeed basic relics or common relics so they will be found at shops we're probably going to pick up the bold orb might as well it's a pierce orb so yeah we'll grab it but we don't need to worry about upgrading it by any means Upgrading it's not necessarily uh, important to us by any means necessary. Two bombs, three bombs, I guess is fine. Wipe the map. We do want as much Mune as we possibly can. <laughs> Perfect. And now we'll hit this bomb because we don't want to take any damage from these bats. And now let's see if we can hit some of these gold. There's a lot of gold on this side of the map. That works. We'll continue on, not worry about upgrades. We will want to force going right. Uh, let's remove all orbs, right? We don't really have too much of a particular build we're going on here. Yeah, we had that bold orb, but eh, we don't care about it. Nothing new. Tactical treat will be fine. We can buy one of these relics. None of these seem great either. I guess dumbbell might be helpful going forward oh no if i delete why why because if we fight the elite we can get the new ones because the new relics are indeed um rare relics so they only come in elite fights versus the other ones the salt shaker and the grabby hand that appear anywhere because they're common Oh, that's sad that we didn't fight this elite, but we will take the upgrade here because there's no shop that we want. We want that elite fight. Continue on. We do want the ice one, the ice sphere relic thing, because that one gives Pierce more bombs, I suppose. Since we have stronger bombs, might as well get more bombs. Uh, we're definitely going to throw you over here because you can hit this crit and do a lot more damage at the start. Boom, and now that builds up. We can throw you here and you're going to hit this crit. Perfect, builds even more damage. All that damage into a singular target is not great. Going to build you up. 150 is great. Don't get me wrong. Ooh, not bad, 114. 
that ends it. We can upgrade again. I guess upgrading again is going to be fine. Boom. Ooh. Duplication. You kind of have to grab the duplication potion whenever you have technical treat, right? It's kind of has to be the case. Well, that was kind of sad that we went into the misnavigation for no reason whatsoever. Thank you for the bomb hit. Now I just wouldn't mind if we got a recombobulator if you're going to do that. We're doing so much damage here. It's so nice. Look at that. Beautiful. The Ouroboros is definitely the goat when it comes to orbs. Might as well as heal. There was no healing orb there, so... Maybe we get a rest orb or something. Unicorn horn is going to be a little bit more useful than an amidextionary. So no new relics found in the first fight here. We're actually going to target this bat. We do not like bats around here. We do not like bats is what I said. And one last time, I said, we do not like bats around these parts. And now we'll just take care of everyone else. Just like that. Easy peasy. Now we'll just heal all the way up because there's no healing relic. I mean, healing orbs there. Then we'll take on the boss. The boss isn't going to have any of our new relics. <laughs> so... We'll just live our life how it plays out, I suppose. Might as well just hit you and ensure that we hit the crit. Not great locations for our refreshes, but we're hitting crits at least. And then we can hit this refresh. Can we hit the crit and refresh at once? I think there's a way. If there's a will, there's a way, right? We'll just throw it right here and hope for the best. We didn't do it, but we still did over 200 damage. So it doesn't matter in the end. It doesn't even matter. Perfect. Not too shabby. Not too shabby. The gift that keeps on giving. I mean, why would I not want the gift that keeps on giving, right? <clears throat> Slowly losing my voice. Uh, boom. Trying to do multiple things at once isn't great, but on the hunt for... We're on the hunt for some relics. So we're going to fight this elite. Because that ensures that we get two relic choices. We get this rare relic, and then we get the base common relic that's inside the case there. Because there's one relic that I really want, and it's got to do with Frost, and it's going to be so nice to have. I thought that was a Nosferbatu for a second. Okay, we got to ensure we go left here. Because left has our ticket. Our ticket to ride. Well, hello, good sir. I th imagine we would do fine against you. Especially with how many refreshes and crits we're going to be having. Nice refresh. Oh, thank you for hitting a crit or having a crit for us. Boom. Boom. Now one more of these throws and we are good. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. That's exactly how we roll. There's no shop. So, well, I know you got self damage. Applies Bramble 2 on hit. Brambles deal 8 damage per Bramble level to passing enemies. I just don't think the self damage there is nice. I just don't think it's worth it. 15. That almost is perfect. 
Uh, we don't need bomb bullet, and we don't need more bombs. We do need a safety net. We do need a safety net, I believe. We do want to ensure... I guess it doesn't matter which way. We kind of risked it for whatnot. And now this time is going to be quite difficult. Because we have to go through a shield, and then we have to go through a person, then we have to go through a shield, then we have to go through a person. <clears throat> it's going to be <laughs> the never-ending story. But at least we're taking out shields first try every time. And then we'll take out a person first try this time. Easy peasy. And now we'll take out a shield first try this time. And then a person taking out first try is going to be a little bit more difficult here, but definitely doable. Uh, nothing good there, so we'll continue on. We do want to go left, I think. Yes, we do want to go left. Ensure the left pathing so we can get that chest. Ooh, we do want strange brew, believe it or not. We want that strangish brew. Yes. Perfect. Because activate refresh and crits contribute to damage. We're going to have so many crits and refreshes due to tactical treat with the duplication potion. Still no? Come on now. Refill the buster will be fine, I suppose. But come on. Where's all the new relics? I figured it, they would have the uh, algorithm set to where we get the new relics instantly. Unlock them, bad boys. Oh, uh, the Orboros just makes me so happy to watch. Problem here is, I don't think there's a way we can avoid taking... Maybe there is a way to avoid taking damage here without having any pierce. Yeah, we should be able to do this without losing any health. Yeah, we have it built up so much, 300 some odd. That's, I could have thrown it straight down and it would have done the trick. Finish, go straight down. We don't need more Monet. We do need a game plan which direction we want to go. I kind of want to go this way for the shop because I can buy more relics at the shop instead of that free relic. You know? Well, that's not enough to take out a shield. At least there's no ranged units on this map. This map definitely is anti uh, gift that keeps on giving. Stop putting stuff inside, please. Oh shoot, you stacked up quick. We will target you though. Now you're going to be taking out a shield. Look at where all of our refreshes are respawning to. Oh, thank you. We don't need the refresh yet, though. Oh, that plus five is so nice. The safety net with it. So nice. Now we have to worry about the shield. Well, no more shields. We don't have to worry about refreshes either because our compounding damage is more than enough to take out the enemy. Our echo damage, no healing orbs. We'll just continue on. I don't need the health. We do want to go right though. We want to go on the far right because we want to get to that shop. We do want to target you in case we hit a refresh somewhere along the lines. That wasn't even enough. The bomb was though. All right, if we had some pierce over hammer or something going on here, that would be nice. We don't have it, so I will just take 
what we have to offer. I'm kind of just clicking and going because not much more we can do now aside from click and go. Aiming's not necessarily a requirement because base damage does more than enough to take him out. We are going to heal here. Unfortunately, we are spending some money on heals because we don't have any healing orbs and I don't think it's presented to us any new relics, any healing orbs, anything like that. Still none. I guess we have no pierce. So grabby hand's not going to be helpful. Bad cheese, 20 damage per numbers of reload is probably our best bet. Going forward, take this question mark. We'll fight it instead of take the three stones. We don't need to fight it by any means. Fighting does nothing to hurt us. Slow you down. Ensure that we find a way to do more than 299 damage to you. Slow down and ensure we do more than 239 damage to you. And we need to ensure we're doing more than 175, which we are doing more than 175 pretty easily. You say? Perfect. Sorry, I was reading something as I was playing. Uh, it's actually, if we buy here, we're fine. We still have plenty of gold for three different relics at the shop. There is four relics at the shop, so maybe if we can get 40, 50 gold out of this, that would be perfect, but I don't think there's 50 gold in a map. For refreshing purposes, we are targeting you because refillabuster takes damage. I know it only did seven, but... Seven's a starting point for sure. That sucks. This is all going into a shield. But we are staying alive. Staying alive. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh, staying alive. Who is our boss here? The wall? Thank the Lord it's the wall. If it was the other one, I think we would have probably lost. If I were to be completely honest with you, we probably would lose. If it was the Ballista. Because we have no piercing. And no sustain, actually. We have zero sustain. We have no healing. Absolutely still no healing. We don't need to worry about health against the final boss here because it's a one shot the walls are just a one shot still new new relics come on now still no new relics uh, i guess more gold round guards fine i think pocket sand might be more helpful that's gross it's more sad than gross, I have to say. Let's see if we can find a way to hit this crit down here. We did not hit the crit. We went far from the crit. Let's see if we can hit this crit and build up some points. Let's see if we can build up some damage. All this max damage here that's going to be happening is going to go straight into the wall, which will be nice. Well, no refresh is getting hit here, no crits getting hit here, but 900 some odd damage is fine in my book, fine and dandy for sure. Nice crit hit, this is gonna be big. Boom. And then we can just throw you on out here and do something like that. Oh, yes. Can you get up to 200? I mean, 2,000? No, you got to 1,500. Well, now crits are going to start meaning nothing to us. We're going to be fine against this wall for sure. For sure we're fine against the wall. I think just post wall is going to be... Not post wall. Just getting... 
I don't think we will have any trouble. I guess piercing might be an issue at some point, but we got through this act, and this act is very pierce heavy. Well, that sucks. We still got stuck. I thought that was a bug, but I guess, I guess not. I guess not. There's an Oscar Batu that we've been looking for ever so nicely. Might as well as upgrade an Oscar Batu. Might as well as upgrade it all the way. Be done with it. Ooh, there's the new one. All orbs get morbid, but boards contain one less refresh. You know, we don't have any more refresh. So we have no refresh. So we have no refresh, so that's not going to be helpful. <laughs> um, mm, sealed Conviction might be helpful for us. I think Sealed Conviction is going to be very helpful for us because we have Amidectionary, so we can skip at least once. So it essentially nullifies each other out, and we just have plus one, plus one. We don't have Amidectionary. I thought we had ambidextionary. That's kind of sad. Well, maybe we can find ambidextionary somewhere along this path. Because that's going to be annoying. We're going to start with the Nosferbatu every time. Here's a level 3 stone. Why would we ever want one of those? Someone riddled to me that. Why that would be healing. Boom. Boom, boom, boom. Not shabby. And... Boom. We are a-okay. Dang it. I thought I could one-shot you. So we need to find an ambidextionary. I don't know if we got the rest orb instead of the pult orb guys, but I mean not pult orb guys, but the neck orb mancer. We do want to go right though. We want to ensure a right path. Thank you. We did not ensure it. Um, um duplicate all orbs to keep it random orb. I guess. Two Nos for Batus back to back. It's kind of gross. Ah, Lord Boros level three. I will take that for sure. I will take a Orb Boros level three duplication because this is going to be uh, quite thick. Well, this specific map is actually anti. There's quite a few of these maps that are kind of anti. Uh, gift that keeps on giving I have to say I was hoping for that refresh that crit though Ew, not enough you can hit this refresh I know you can you have the capabilities Perfect. Perfect. We're hitting a lot of refreshes, which are not necessarily required by us, but not bad, not bad. We'll continue on our journey. We'll fight the elite fight. If we start with the Nosferbatu, that would be nice. We don't start with the Nosferbatu, but starting with a you taking out each individual caricature one at a time, I guess will be a-okay. You don't only focus. Heals you and damages all enemies for two times amount healed. Oh shoot, we'll heal for what? 32? So 64 damage to all enemies? I mean, we're one-shotting every enemy right now with the Orboros, so... It's all coming together, I suppose. All these enemies have to have less than a thousand health points. 
good refresh on your way out because the Nosferatu is going to heal us by hitting a refresh for sure you actually did not hit that refresh oh I forgot it does self damage too so it's 47 damage times 2 is 93 damage to all enemies I will take that 94 actually did it round up or something still going how many attempts must we have 90 who's in front of us it's doing damage to us there we go we got through it <clears throat> there's a new one projectile attacks pierce an additional enemy this is what i was looking for this is what we needed that is what we needed now we're gonna go here we're gonna get salt shaker or uh gardener's glove no get neither one but we will grab an apple a day we'll grab crabby hand because now we have pierce projectile attacks pierce an additional enemy and now that means we just solidified the fact that we are going to beat the wall uh, the qr code i'm sure well, now we don't get to practice it or utilize it at all during this fight, at least. Look at that refresh location. If we didn't have Tactical Treat, no way we're hitting that refresh, right? Tell me one way we would hit that refresh. Getting through all that, I just don't... I don't see that happening. I don't see that happening, champ. Well, we might lose some health here because we are obviously not doing that much damage. I kind of forgot you were the... I would have thrown you a little bit more wise if I paid attention to what I was throwing there. Uh, we'll continue on. I think Power Glove will be fine. Plus one, plus one is beautiful. Technically, if we go left, we'll be better off. Boom. Because if we go left and left again, we'll have this. Eye of the turtle. Eye of the turtle will be nice. Ooh, maybe we should have taken the elite fight. But this will be fine. More options for... Please be an elite fight, elite fight, elite fight, elite fight. No, red bomb fight instead. Exact opposite of elite fight. Ah, oh, that Pierce is so nice though. Do you see that? See it doing its work? Oh, yes. That is such a good one. Imagine that one with Overhammer 2. Oh, well, that sucked. But you know what doesn't suck about it, though? The fact that it pierces straight through. So I'm not wasting all that damage on a guy that's got level 1. I mean, only 1 health. Mm. Red bomb fight, you mean nothing to us. Now look at these. Level 3 Swarb, no special effect, so it's still kind of useless. Like, a Swarb is not that good. It's not good, champ. Not good. I guess the Puppet's fine. Inconspicuous Ring, where bouncers just contribute to damage, is fine, too. Uh, I suppose we have to throw you. One twelve, so it does still echo over, even though it wasn't technically damage dealt from the Nosferatu, but it still does have echo from the Nosferatu, which is nice. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, this is so nice. I love this relic. I think this might be one of my favorite relics now. I have 
One of my favorite relics is the refill buster. Another one now is the ice rod. It's called the ice rod. You need to remember that. Ice rod. And then we love the um, recombobulator. And we love the... Um, where is it? Round guard, of course. And we like safety net. And gift that keeps on giving. All of those were delicious choices. Well, I don't think we're going to get a chance to heal here. There's another Nosferbatu. We don't need. We'll actually continue on because... Uh, it's the shop, so yes, we don't want to buy anything here. Um, 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 we're going to get the cookie, of course. And I guess complex claw. Cookie and complex claw. Cookie's going to heal us every refresh, which is nice. Starting with an 8, 12... Nos for Bo or Boros is not bad. No crit was necessary there. Or Boros, you're kind of scaring me here a little bit. I am getting quite scared because our Nosferbatu is not in a great location either. Got rid of one of them. Dang it. <laughs> but we got the ice rod. Check it out. Check it out. Check it out. Check it out. Ooh, there it is. The projectiles attacks pierce an enemy. So good it's so good well thank you so much for uh joining i think we discovered a new favorite relic for sure but uh thank you so much and i look forward to talking with you all later Bye bye